Well, a bet is a bet, and yes, former Golden Gopher Nick Bukestead wearing the Minnesota State Maverick hat. This has to be painful. It's painful. I didn't know I was doing it right now. I think that's why I got my name called out here to do the interview. Um, but yeah, Dan Myers, um, you know, good season for Mankato as well as Minnesota too. But um, you know, bet's a bet. Got to wear the hat. Probably takes the sting out of it with the way this game went today. Kings are a team that's trying to get in the playoffs. They're up 3 nothing. You guys completely flipped the script. What was talked about on the bench, and what did you do to do it on the ice? You know what? There wasn't too much said in the locker room. Was, uh, I mean, we kind of knew what to do. Um, you know, you start off slow like that. Um, you got to find ways to get energy, and, um, you know, that, that definitely happened with Boldy right away. And, uh, you know, everyone just started to roll after that, so... Um, this is a team that's been in that position plenty of times, obviously not ideal, but uh, to be able to battle back and um, play the way we did the last two periods was, was huge. I'm sure it's great to have the depth that you have, but it's also difficult for folks like you that have different players shuffling in and out of your line, yet your line continues to be productive. How have you done it? Uh, it's just playing straight lines for the most part. Um, you know, we, we know kind of our role. We've got to bring energy and um, try to play in their zone as much as possible. And uh, you know, we got plenty of guys that can do that. So it's a deep lineup, and uh, you know, it's a it's a team that everyone kind of contributes. So it's it's fun to be a part of. Somewhere there's former teammates of yours at a bar, restaurant all over the country, not having volume right now. Seeing you with that hat. So tip of the hat to you for doing this, and congrats on a big win. Yeah, thanks, Gorgie. Go Gophers. <laughs> <laughs>